My name is Dr. Beatrice Muridi. I'm a research scientist, an agricultural and development economist, and I work with the Social Science and Impact Assessment Unit of ISIPE. ISIPE is a research institute that uh, does mostly applied research. Both of the projects are very exciting that we find solutions. And uh, just to give one example of the current project I'm working on, uh, it's titled Integrated Sustainable Production of Tomatoes. We are looking at ways or solutions for minimizing the use of chemical pesticides in tomato production. And through this project, I am um, doing gender mainstreaming, so bringing women into um, the value chain of tomato. So I hope to achieve one uh, women empowerment. Uh, women will be able to have income that they can make decisions uh, with. And second, I'm also mentoring women in the project. We have uh, two students, female students, whom I'm mentoring and who I hope they will achieve their, their, their MSc uh, degree, but also preparing for the next steps of their career in research. One of the interests that got me when I, this program was announced, I wanted to enhance my mentorship skills. I also wanted to learn more of the formal mentoring processes, learn more about mentoring tools, but also build my networks in the agricultural economics, uh, networks of, 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 of women, and also partnerships through which I can um, raise more funding for capacity building, but also for my career development. This training program has exposed me to very essential skills for mentoring. For instance, listening skills, communication skills, and um, also some tools, for instance, having a purpose roadmap right from the beginning of the mentorship. Also, you know, developing mentorship goals a mentorship agreement. As a mentor, I'm able to prepare my students well, I'm able to prepare even the interns well, and walking through a journey, you know, setting some time schedule that we are going to achieve a certain goal. We are in a career where uh, male are dominance. And for women to be able to participate fully, or rather to be able to climb to that higher career ladder, because in this career, women get filtered out, right from undergraduate, masters, and PhD. And I want to give an example of my own mentee that I've mentored during this program. When we started a, our mentorship um, a program together, she was very shy and demotivated because of the male dominance um, in, in her office, we were able to overcome some of the challenges that she was going through. She is able to move from where she was now to where she is in terms of the confidence in leadership, in terms of, um, you know, the positioning of herself, negotiating for positions within her department, she's able to do this. So for me, that has been a very satisfying journey as a mentor. And uh, from this program, I have acquired much more skills that I am able even to bring more women into the level I am and even, even beyond. Thank you so, so much, Award, for, for giving me this opportunity to mentor um, and also to learn uh, the formal mentorship processes, to learn the mentorship tools, but also to be able to apply them. When I am given a role to read, like uh, now I'm, I'm doing the gender mainstreaming with most of our projects, so I am confident with what I am doing because of the skills and the training that this um, award has, has offered me. Uh, mentoring is going to be key for us to be able to bring more women up. And that for me is the biggest take home.